Hello and welcome to the English is with you channel. Episode 2, 60 English phrases for daily use, letter A to F, phrases, explanations and example sentences of English pronunciation. As good as gold. As good as gold. Well behaved and reliable, trustworthy and dependable. Well behaved and reliable, trustworthy and dependable. Despite the mischievous behavior, the child was as good as gold during the party. Despite the mischievous behavior, the child was as good as gold during the party. As light as a feather. As light as a feather. Extremely lightweight, comparable to a feather's weight. Extremely lightweight, comparable to a feather's weight. After months of hard work, she finally achieved her goal weight and now feels as light as a feather. After months of hard work, she finally achieved her goal weight and now feels as light as a feather. As mad as a hatter. As mad as a hatter. Completely insane or crazy, often due to mercury exposure. Completely insane or crazy, often due to mercury exposure. The artist's eccentric behavior and bizarre artwork prove that he was as mad as a hatter. The artist's eccentric behavior and bizarre artwork prove that he was as mad as a hatter. As old as the hills. As old as the hills. Extremely old or ancient, dating back a long time. Extremely old or ancient, dating back a long time. The concept of storytelling is as old as the hills, passed down from generation to generation. The concept of storytelling is as old as the hills, passed down from generation to generation. As sharp as attack. As sharp as attack. It means to be very intelligent or mentally quick. It means to be very intelligent or mentally quick. Even at 90 years old, my grandmother's mind is still as sharp as a tack. Even at 90 years old, my grandmother's mind is still as sharp as a tack. As thick as thieves. As thick as thieves. To be very close friends and share secrets, etc. To be very close friends and share secrets, etc. The band members were as thick as thieves, always supporting each other and creating beautiful music. The band members were as thick as thieves, always supporting each other and creating beautiful music. At a loss. At a loss. Confused or uncertain about what to do next. Confused or uncertain about what to do next. After hours of searching, I'm still at a loss as to where I left my keys. After hours of searching, I'm still at a loss as to where I left my keys. At the drop of a hat. At the drop of a hat. It means to do something quickly without hesitation. It means to do something quickly without hesitation. He was always ready to defend his friends at the drop of a hat, no questions asked. He was always ready to defend his friends at the drop of a hat, no questions asked. Back to square one. Back to square one. To return to the starting point or beginning. To return to the starting point or beginning. After discovering a mistake, we had to go back to square one and start the project over. After discovering a mistake, we had to go back to square one and start the project over. Back to the drawing board. Back to the drawing board. It means returning to the beginning to try again. It means returning to the beginning to try again. We thought our plan was foolproof, but it failed miserably, so it's back to the drawing board. We thought our plan was foolproof, but it failed miserably, so it's back to the drawing board. Barking up the wrong tree. 
barking up the wrong tree. It means pursuing a mistaken or misdirected course of action. It means pursuing a mistaken or misdirected course of action. My old sister thought I didn't like her surprise, but she was barking up the wrong tree, I loved it. My old sister thought I didn't like her surprise, but she was barking up the wrong tree, I loved it. Beat around the bush. Beat around the bush. It means to avoid the main topic or issue. It means to avoid the main topic or issue. Stop beating around the bush and tell me what you really think about my idea. Stop beating around the bush and tell me what you really think about my idea. Beggars can't be choosers. Beggars can't be choosers. When in need, you have to accept what's available. When in need, you have to accept what's available. She wasn't thrilled with the job offer, but being unemployed, she knew beggars can't be choosers. She wasn't thrilled with the job offer, but being unemployed, she knew beggars can't be choosers. Best of both worlds. Best of both worlds. With a convertible car, you can enjoy the best of both worlds, a coupe and a roadster. With a convertible car, you can enjoy the best of both worlds, a coupe and a roadster. With a convertible car, you can enjoy the best of both worlds, a coupe and a roadster. With a convertible car, you can enjoy the best of both worlds, a coupe and a roadster. Bite the bullet. Bite the bullet. To endure a difficult or unpleasant situation bravely. To endure a difficult or unpleasant situation bravely. Although the surgery was painful, she had to bite the bullet and go through with it for her health. Although the surgery was painful, she had to bite the bullet and go through with it for her health. Bitter pill to swallow. Bitter pill to swallow. A difficult or unpleasant fact that someone must accept. A difficult or unpleasant fact that someone must accept. Losing the election was a bitter pill to swallow, but we'll regroup and try again next time. Losing the election was a bitter pill to swallow, but we'll regroup and try again next time. Blow off steam. Blow off steam. To release stress or tension by doing something enjoyable. To release stress or tension by doing something enjoyable. Engaging in a physical activity you enjoy can help you blow off steam and reduce stress levels effectively. Engaging in a physical activity you enjoy can help you blow off steam and reduce stress levels effectively. Bottom line. Bottom line. The essential conclusion or main point. The essential conclusion or main point. The bottom line is that we need to increase sales if we want to stay in business. The bottom line is that we need to increase sales if we want to stay in business. Break a leg. Break a leg. A phrase used to wish someone good luck. A phrase used to wish someone good luck. I am confident you'll ace your interview today, so go ahead and break a leg. I am confident you'll ace your interview today, so go ahead and break a leg. Break the ice. Break the ice. To overcome the initial awkwardness or tension in a situation. To overcome the initial awkwardness or tension in a situation. I always bring up my love for dogs to break the ice when meeting new people. I always bring up my love for dogs to break the ice when meeting new people. Burn the midnight oil. Burn the midnight oil. To work or study late into the night. To work or study late into the night. I need to burn the midnight oil to finish this project before the deadline tomorrow. 
I need to burn the midnight oil to finish this project before the deadline tomorrow. Butterflies in your stomach. Butterflies in your stomach. The sensation of nervousness or excitement in anticipation. The sensation of nervousness or excitement in anticipation. I always get butterflies in my stomach before speaking in public, no matter how prepared I am. I always get butterflies in my stomach before speaking in public, no matter how prepared I am. By the book. By the book. To follow rules or guidelines strictly and precisely. To follow rules or guidelines strictly and precisely. The police officer followed the procedures by the book when handling the sensitive case. The police officer followed the procedures by the book when handling the sensitive case. By the skin of one's teeth. By the skin of one's teeth. To narrowly avoid failure or defeat. To narrowly avoid failure or defeat. I completed the marathon by the skin of my teeth but I'm proud of myself for not giving up. I completed the marathon by the skin of my teeth, but I'm proud of myself for not giving up. Call it a day. Call it a day. To stop working or doing something for the rest of the day. To stop working or doing something for the rest of the day. We've been working hard for hours, let's call it a day and go home to relax. We've been working hard for hours, let's call it a day and go home to relax. Carry the torch. Carry the torch. To continue a tradition or idea. To continue a tradition or idea. My grandfather dedicated his life to charity, and now it's my turn to carry the torch. My grandfather dedicated his life to charity, and now it's my turn to carry the torch. Catch-22 Catch-22 A situation where there is no good outcome or solution. A situation where there is no good outcome or solution. I want to go on vacation, but I can't take time off work, it's a catch-22. I want to go on vacation, but I can't take time off work, it's a catch-22. Catch someone's eye. Catch someone's eye. To attract someone's attention. To attract someone's attention. My artwork caught the eye of a gallery owner, and now I have my first exhibition next month. My artwork caught the eye of a gallery owner, and now I have my first exhibition next month. Change one's tune. Change one's tune. To change one's opinion or attitude about something. To change one's opinion or attitude about something. At first, he didn't support the idea, but after hearing the benefits, he quickly changed his tune. At first, he didn't support the idea, but after hearing the benefits, he quickly changed his tune. Chip on one shoulder. Chip on one shoulder. An attitude of hostility or resentment. An attitude of hostility or resentment. She always brags about her achievements, but it's just a cover for the chip on her shoulder. She always brags about her achievements, but it's just a cover for the chip on her shoulder. Cold turkey. Cold turkey. Suddenly stopping a habit or addiction. Suddenly stopping a habit or addiction. After smoking for years, he decided to quit cold turkey and hasn't touched a cigarette since. After smoking for years, he decided to quit cold turkey and hasn't touched a cigarette since. Come full circle. Come full circle. To return to where one started. To return to where one started. After many ups and downs, their relationship has come full circle and they're finally getting married. 
After many ups and downs, their relationship has come full circle and they're finally getting married. Cry over spilled milk. Cry over spilled milk. To be upset about something that can't be changed. To be upset about something that can't be changed. I learned from my mistake and won't cry over spilled milk, instead, I'll focus on finding a solution. I learned from my mistake and won't cry over spilled milk, instead, I'll focus on finding a solution. Cut corners. Cut corners. To do something poorly or take shortcuts to save time or money. To do something poorly or take shortcuts to save time or money. The contractor decided to cut corners, resulting in shoddy workmanship and a dissatisfied client. The contractor decided to cut corners, resulting in shoddy workmanship and a dissatisfied client. Cut somebody some slack. Cut somebody some slack. To be lenient or forgiving with someone. To be lenient or forgiving with someone. I know she made a mistake, but let's cut her some slack and give her a chance to make it right. I know she made a mistake, but let's cut her some slack and give her a chance to make it right. Cut to the chase. Cut to the chase. To get to the point or essential information. To get to the point or essential information. Why beat around the bush? Cut to the chase and let's focus on the most important aspects of this project. Why beat around the bush? Cut to the chase and let's focus on the most important aspects of this project. Cut the mustard. Cut the mustard. To meet expectations or perform satisfactorily. To meet expectations or perform satisfactorily. I'm not sure if this new employee can cut the mustard in this fast-paced and demanding environment. I'm not sure if this new employee can cut the mustard in this fast-paced and demanding environment. Dead as a doornail. Dead as a doornail. Completely and unmistakably dead or lifeless. Completely and unmistakably dead or lifeless. When I found my phone in the pool, it was dead as a doornail and beyond repair. When I found my phone in the pool, it was dead as a doornail and beyond repair. Devil's Advocate Devil's Advocate Challenging an idea to examine its strengths or weaknesses. Challenging an idea to examine its strengths or weaknesses. Let me play devil's advocate here. Have you considered the downside of this proposal? Let me play devil's advocate here. Have you considered the downside of this proposal? Diamond in the rough. Diamond in the rough. Unpolished potential with hidden talent or value. Unpolished potential with hidden talent or value. Although unrefined, the young musician possessed immense talent, a true diamond in the rough. Although unrefined, the young musician possessed immense talent, a true diamond in the rough. Don't judge a book by its cover. Don't judge a book by its cover. Don't judge someone or something based solely on appearance. Don't judge someone or something based solely on appearance. She may seem quiet, but don't judge a book by its cover, she's actually very intelligent and outgoing. She may seem quiet, but don't judge a book by its cover, she's actually very intelligent and outgoing. Down to the wire. Down to the wire. Last minute or critical moment of a situation. Last minute or critical moment of a situation. We were down to the wire, but we managed to finish the project on time. We were down to the wire, but we managed to finish the project on time. Draw a blank. Draw a blank. To be unable to remember or think of something. 
to be unable to remember or think of something. I'm sorry, I'm drawing a blank, I can't recall where I put your keys. I'm sorry, I'm drawing a blank, I can't recall where I put your keys. Draw the line. Draw the line. Set a boundary or limit for acceptable behavior. Set a boundary or limit for acceptable behavior. I'm willing to help, but I have to draw the line when it comes to working on weekends. I'm willing to help, but I have to draw the line when it comes to working on weekends. Drive someone up the wall. Drive someone up the wall. To annoy or frustrate someone to the point of exasperation. To annoy or frustrate someone to the point of exasperation. My co-worker's constant humming is driving me up the wall and I can't concentrate on my work. My co-worker's constant humming is driving me up the wall and I can't concentrate on my work. Drop a bombshell. Drop a bombshell. Deliver shocking or unexpected news or information. Deliver shocking or unexpected news or information. At the meeting, the CEO dropped a bombshell by announcing massive layoffs that no one saw coming. At the meeting, the CEO dropped a bombshell by announcing massive layoffs that no one saw coming. Drop the ball. Drop the ball. To make an error or fail at something important. To make an error or fail at something important. I dropped the ball on the project and forgot to send the final report to the client. I dropped the ball on the project and forgot to send the final report to the client. Elephant in the room. Elephant in the room. An obvious problem or issue that is being ignored or avoided. An obvious problem or issue that is being ignored or avoided. Everyone knows that we're having financial problems, but nobody wants to address the elephant in the room. Everyone knows that we're having financial problems, but nobody wants to address the elephant in the room. Every cloud has a silver lining. Every cloud has a silver lining. Every negative situation has a positive aspect. Every negative situation has a positive aspect. Even though I didn't get the job, every cloud has a silver lining, I can now focus on other opportunities. Even though I didn't get the job, every cloud has a silver lining, I can now focus on other opportunities. Eye-opening. Eye-opening. Revealing or surprising in a way that changes one's perspective. Revealing or surprising in a way that changes one's perspective. The documentary was eye-opening and made me more aware of the issues surrounding climate change. The documentary was eye-opening and made me more aware of the issues surrounding climate change. Face the music. Face the music. To accept the consequences of one's actions. To accept the consequences of one's actions. After weeks of procrastination, I finally have to face the music and study for my final exams. After weeks of procrastination, I finally have to face the music and study for my final exams. Fairweather friend. Fairweather friend. Someone who is only a friend when things are going well. Someone who is only a friend when things are going well. When I was going through a tough time, my fair weather friend was nowhere to be found. When I was going through a tough time, my fair weather friend was nowhere to be found. Feather in one's cap. Feather in one's cap. An accomplishment or achievement to be proud of. An accomplishment or achievement to be proud of. Being awarded the Nobel Prize was a feather in his cap, and he was hailed as a hero. Being awarded the Nobel Prize was a feather in his cap, 
and he was hailed as a hero. Feel the pinch. Feel the pinch. To experience financial discomfort or hardship. To experience financial discomfort or hardship. Due to the pandemic of COVID-19, many people are starting to feel the pinch and struggle financially. Due to the pandemic of COVID-19, many people are starting to feel the pinch and struggle financially. Fish out of water. Fish out of water. Uncomfortable in unfamiliar surroundings or situation. Uncomfortable in unfamiliar surroundings or situation. As a vegetarian, going to a steakhouse for dinner made me feel like a fish out of water. As a vegetarian, going to a steakhouse for dinner made me feel like a fish out of water. Fit like a glove. Fit like a glove. Perfectly fitting and tailored to one's needs. Perfectly fitting and tailored to one's needs. After searching for weeks, I finally found a pair of running shoes that fit like a glove. After searching for weeks, I finally found a pair of running shoes that fit like a glove. Flying by the seat of one's pants. Flying by the seat of one's pants. To do something based on intuition or experience. To do something based on intuition or experience. Even though I didn't have a plan, I managed to complete the project by flying by the seat of my pants. Even though I didn't have a plan, I managed to complete the project by flying by the seat of my pants. Foot in the door. Foot in the door. An opportunity to start a career or make a connection. An opportunity to start a career or make a connection. I'm hoping to get my foot in the door with this internship and eventually land a full-time position. I'm hoping to get my foot in the door with this internship and eventually land a full-time position. For the birds. For the birds. Something that is worthless or unimportant. Something that is worthless or unimportant. The company's promises turned out to be for the birds, and they didn't deliver on anything they said. The company's promises turned out to be for the birds, and they didn't deliver on anything they said. Full of beans. Full of beans. Energetic, enthusiastic, lively, or full of life. Energetic, enthusiastic, lively, or full of life. Despite his age, my grandfather is still full of beans and loves to go for long walks every day. Despite his age, my grandfather is still full of beans and loves to go for long walks every day. Thank you for watching. If you liked our video and found it useful, please subscribe, like, click the notification bell, and share it with others. All of you have a great day.